So I've actually had the opportunity to shadow in Henry Ford Hospital. And a story that I love to tell people is, people don't know that Detroit has a very large his, or Spanish speaking population. So I was in the ER and in the um, operating room next to us, there was an emergency, like a mother and a baby and they were both um, not doing too hot. So when we were in the other operating room, the the patient spoke no English and everyone else in the uh, operating room was trying to communicate with her so that they can get um, her IV in and her um, epidural. And you know when people speak to someone who doesn't speak their language they just speak really loudly. I was the only person in there who spoke Spanish because of my Spanish minor and I was like okay I'm not really supposed to be here I'm just shadowing but I stepped in and I spoke to her in Spanish I was like tell me the directions and I'll give them to her and the, the head anesthesiologist came in and said Carrington thank you and I was like oh no problem I'm glad I could help and then he said when you graduate medical school and if you're looking for a job and you remember my name call me so it's just cool that in Detroit we have the opportunity to be just exposed to so many different people, so many different cultures, and the things that we learn in college can actually help us in real life situations.